Okay, hello everyone and welcome to the Fun Attack Global Challenge at Lime Rock Park. Um, qualifying went absolutely horrible. I got a 1x in my first lap and then uh, I lost about 3 tenths in the first sector on my second run. So, pole would have been possible or at least P2 to start up front. Um, now P5 at the track where overtaking us again really difficult. It's kind of easy if you can just qualify first and then run away. And now I'm starting in fifth, so this will be an adventure, let's call it that. Well, let's see. I'm not really good at Lime Rock either, and I'm pretty tired now, so... Let's try to make the best out of this. Okay, that's not too bad. Somehow I'm super nervous right now. Can't really explain why. Oh, this will be the really hard part. Thank you. 
That was unnecessary. Oh god, no. I hit one apex too much and missed the next two for that. Well, stuff happens when you're stupid. Somehow got loose there. Didn't have that happen before. Can't get this turn one right. Seems impossible for me to do. This whole complex is. Well, the reason why I'm not good at Lime Rock is because I can't get the corners right. Just not comfortable right now. Car understeers in one corner, then oversteers in the next one. Tires will also really hate this, so I don't expect the situation to improve.
Good save, man. Good save. Cody, I hope you don't crash again. Ah, that was more luck, Nathan. More luck. If you have a run of that time. Just not feeling confident and on a track where there's no asphalt runoff areas. That's about the worst thing that can happen to you. A win here would have been good for the championship for me. Because of course the three best SOFs were the three races before this one and I wasn't there for them. Although I have been looking out for good SOFs the whole weekend from Friday afternoon onwards. And when I'm not there the SOFs appear just my luck I guess great That guy didn't really know what he was doing. Stayed on the inside for a high commitment corner. But didn't lift. Lap traffic kind of was my only chance to get close to Medi again. But yeah, I just got separated further.
a lot from this play, Mason. Well, thank you. Getting a start for the front for them. Jakob is nice, that's really nice. Ten laps to go I guess, including this one. Don't think we are fast enough right now to make 30 laps. just because we aren't really fast. Well held, sir, well, well held. If you stay on throttle over the little crest there, well, it's not a little crest, but... The crest. Um, then the back end can just step out on you. That's why you see me lifting there all the time. Just because I don't want to risk the second place even if I would need to win to gain in the yeah, championship. Properly. The last few results have kind of shown, or it has kind of developed into kind of the Watkins Glen race, the incident there with that Kia, right. costing me a second place in the championship. It, 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 once again, you drove into the side of my car. No, you just drove it to me. Come on. Second place has now become pretty much impossible. Now it's just for third against Sebastian. Next week in Road Atlanta, the final week of the season, I think I need to outscore him by 9 or 10 points. So that will be tough. Especially if I can't race on Monday evening. Well, I will race on Monday evening, but not the Fun Attack Global Challenge because I have a league race there. Well, I found a lot for last couple of days and every perfect is crashing, so I did so much at home. That league will be um. GT3 at Montreal, so get Jill enough. And it's three 20 minute races. So lots of action there.
Yeah, if you want to see me racing there, then head over to Twitch on Monday well, evening, GMT time. Should be about 18.30 GMT. We have another league race on Saturday morning at Phillip Island. And then I'll stream kind of the whole week 13. I got the 500 kilometer race at Monza coming up in the Ford GT together with GT1 class. Then I have the um, World Cup of I Racing Armageddon event, which basically is a demolition derby with street stocks. That's on Saturday evening. Thank you, Ben. Then a GRC event on Sunday noon, I think. And the spec racer for the event on Sunday evening. So week 13 pretty busy for me. Together with some unofficial racing as always. At least I'm not as tired anymore as I was before the race, I guess. Different story to the race on Saturday evening. Yeah, Saturday evening I did one race already there. Didn't record that because my microphone didn't work. Got it fixed like 10 minutes before the race now. Thanks Windows 10 update. But yeah, that was me just getting pole and running up front. And like... I don't know. A few laps before the finish I made a mistake and turned three when I braked on the grass for whatever reason. Lost like three seconds there. Yeah. Just wasn't really concentra concentrated in that one. But now I have something to do and talk and which kind of helps. Always keeps you awake when there's nothing going on race-wise. Second to last lap right now I guess. D class guy to get past. But working nicely, thank you. And we do make it thirty laps, okay. Maybe it was just fast enough to make it. Kind of surprising because I didn't think we were that fast. Well, 
I've dropped off a lot in these last few laps just because there's no point in it. driving on the limit. Okay, he didn't really make it. 2.2 seconds over the 25 second mark, but if it's that close, iRacing often just gives you one more lap, even if the time is up when you cross the finish line to then get onto the final lap. Which was the case now as well, so. Not that I'm bothered. The more laps I do, the more corners I do, and the less safety rating I lose because of my two incidents. So yeah, second place from fifth on the grid. I um, can't really say that I'm too happy about this because I obviously didn't win. And Kinda looking at the championship right now because I would want to finish third in there. But yeah, uh, the start was pretty good from fifth to second uh, in the first two corners. Kinda thought about winning this race after that. But um, yeah. Then just couldn't find confidence and maybe obviously did find some confidence to pull away. But yeah, second is okay from fifth on the grid. And um, shouldn't be helping me in the championship as I said. So it's up to Road Atlanta next week. Okay, the race is over. And uh, yeah, I'll see you there and have a great week.